Lapis. Marble. Canyon? What? We're racing on Marble Canyon, baby. 80 laps, Marble Canyon, dirt racing in the Community Cup. It's not just my dirt series, baby. It's not just the dirt championship that it did in the offseason that it did because the Enders wouldn't let me do dirt tracks otherwise. No, we're actually doing it. <laughs> dirt tracks. Let's go. So who will skip the line today and who will get an extra lap? Yeah, so during the Dirt Championship and other races that I've done, there's a few things I've noticed that can happen on this track. Someone who starts front left, like Dr. Ignatius, maybe Maddie will. Often, when they start, they will go that way. And because this bit is curved, they then go this way. And 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 they keep doing that sometimes. Until the rest of the track, or the rest of the marbles, are all the way over there on that side. Not used to an Alka race before the sun comes up. <laughs> well, I don't often do... This is the first time I've actually done a Community Cup race that doesn't start at either 11 or 12 my time. Usually I do 11. The most of most people I've ever had in a community cup race, I think, is 34, which is in one of my earlier ones in season one. So this is probably going to be my biggest one, which is exciting. Uh, part of the reason I did that because I wanted more people for it being Marble Canyon, and I'm really flipping exciting. But also, this is probably going to be my final community cup race this season for a long time. I don't know. I, like, I'm not saying I will absolutely not do any community cup racing for the rest of the season. But it's unlikely. I have a few different reasons why. Um, one of them just me noticing that. Uh, just maybe physical mental health. I need a bit more um, help with that. And just not having to wake up for a community cup race. Or just being able to sleep through. Take a rest. Other activities that will help me better with that. There's that. There's the sub. There's the... Um, just me not feeling as much like it. It wasn't as much fun anymore. And I realized if it's not fun, I shouldn't just just soon do it i'm still very much enjoying um helping enders set everything up and helping organizing setting up the events for discord so that's absolutely continuing you'll still see me racing for most of the races um but hosting this is probably gonna be my last one of the season i thought i would just do the first race like the opening race last week which i did which was exciting however then ender said that the next time i race this this season I, he would give me a dirt track. So I claimed that for this week immediately. We're doing a dirt track, baby. The first couple of laps, I might just follow the marbles. Although, something else I need to mention. The shortcut. More of a team later on in the race than early. Maybe that's dependent on some speed thingies. I'm not 100% sure. Um, but if, on the exit of turn one, you stay on this hill, you stay on this hill, you stay on this hill, and you go off the hill here. You have enough speed, you can go over this hill over this bit, end up here. And then it'll take a while for the momentum to take you that way again, but since you skip three quarters of the track, you gain about half a lap. Although what we have seen is if you hit an angle wrong, like let's say you end up right here, you push back a bit, you keep going back and forth and back and forth, and that might hurt you for a while, but then you still effectively gain. 
I believe it was Brian during the uh, off-season dirt championship. During one of the races here, Brian did a shortcut, but ended up going that way, and then back, and then he didn't have enough momentum to carry him over the hill once he got there, and Brian got stuck. This was on lap two. The first time the marbles even have enough speed to try the shortcut. So yeah, there's that. Final thing, which has happened to me once as well. If the angle out of the final corner is bad enough that you go super high and wide, like about here, over the finish line, you don't gain a lap. You can go pretty high on this hill and the finish line extends onto the or into the hill. And it's fine. But if you go high enough, very it's very rare. You're not even going to see it every race. But if you go high enough, you might just not gain a lap. Which basically means you're suddenly a lap behind. So that is possible. The shortcut um, is intended. Or this is intended to stay as far as I understand from Pixel. The fact that you can't gain a lap, I understand is not. So maybe that already has been patched out. Or it hasn't. I don't know if that anything has happened to that. I like seeing some of the blue names. Heavis Dios, Wickack, AMS were among the people that got uh, subs or gift subs during the opening race last week. So welcome. At the start, I'm going to take a look at especially Maddie Will, Chibi Manny, Dr. Ignatius. Are any of them going that way and are they going to keep going like that? Alka Marble starting somewhere in the middle. At least he's not going to go back and forth like he's done before. Tenor's relatively close. Sporting that super rare MSLA helmet. One of three people in this world to have it. Brian's another. He's not sporting it right now, but Brian has one. And then Enders has it because he was testing it as a dev. That's all. Alright, 32 marbles, not quite the most I've ever had, but let's get ready to rumble. Community Go Dirt Racing is a go. Yep, Manny and Dr. Ignatius doing what I said they would, but there's enough people behind them to push them forward. Hi, Cat. Hi, Erky. Oh, you want to sit on my lap again? Ow! That's your nails. Nice to see you too. Boogity boogity boogity. Let's go racing. Look, is in the top three. It's me. Even though that's probably not going to take too long. I just let me lead lap one, please. Let me let me win lap one. That would be cool. Like the different angles you can take on these hills are so the how, are so interesting, and how that can alter your race. There's a lot of changes that can happen here. I think this track is really good for random racing because of it. All right, let's go up. Anyone trying the shortcut immediately? Dr. Ignatius going really wide. Ah, uh, went a bit too far. So I think Wickhack went high as well. Didn't quite work out. All right, for most of this race, we will have this overview, because otherwise it's really hard to tell where everyone is with all the hills. Follow the leader! No, AMS, give me first place! I want to take a cool screenshot! <laughs> I want to take a cool screenshot! Give me first place back! I wasn't ready yet! What's Andy Mumrose, the CD you sent me, a uh, DM, I'll look at it in a second. I also noticed that you put something in your ticket in the Discord. My intention was to take a look at it in a moment. Can I just take first place? I want to take a screenshot, like a, let me show you my world, or my track, or something like that. But I need to be in first place for it. So we're going to wait another 
lap, lap and a half maybe, to see if I can get in first place. That's... Nope, I just lost time. Never mind. I'm not even gonna try. I'm gonna watch for the shortcut. Also, if anyone takes the shortcut, whether I call it out or not, because I'm because I see it or not, please someone clip it because I want to see it and I want to share it later. Because the shortcut is really exciting. Anyone going for it? There's a few that get some bumps, but not quite high enough. Total Chaos was trying it, but it didn't quite work, and now they're gonna lose. A lot of time due to a bad angle. Actually, no! Oh, no. Is he gonna get stuck? Is that okay, ass? No, you, okay, you can at least get out. You got out. I thought you didn't have enough momentum. That was an interesting way to tackle it, but due to the angle of those hills, he keeps going back up. He's gonna lose a lap. Total okay, ass? You need a bump from someone? It's a lap behind now. All right, there we go. Now, now we might have the angle to actually continue the race. No, still about to get the, the, just a tiny bit of a bad angle in a corner. No, he's still going backwards. He just needs to have forward momentum and then he can go. Yes, yes. And total chaos is back on the way. Lap behind. <clears throat> wow. I've never seen this before. What the heck? We were so focused on total chaos, I've never seen someone go so high up this one. I saw Final Viper go super high on that hill when trying the shortcut. Um, we have our first DNF. <laughs> um, Final Viper is not making it to the finish line. <laughs> you cannot park there, sir. <laughs> Madam? Uh, the person? I don't know. But, um, it, it's coffee cup? And, uh, it, no? Huh. See, so yeah, that can happen in Marble Canyon. Huh, that, that's interesting. I hadn't seen that one before. Nope. Oh. Amos, Bolster, and Heavenson are leaving. And Final Viper even see the marbles from that, from that spot. I'm gonna take a screenshot of this one. Leon missed the lap. Did they go super wide over the finish line then? They must have, like in the last two laps. They must have gone like super wide over the finish line, like I talked about right at the start. Viper sensed native snake habitat and decided to fight them. Let's see.
think two day after Zagoros. So Thursday? Uh, has anyone Kratos did Kratos shortcut or did Kratos just go fast did I miss something Kratos why, why are you so far ahead did you just go fast because I thought AMS was leading did you shortcut when I wasn't looking did you so if Leon and total and total chaos a lot behind effectively final Viper is stuck Chad, can you confirm, did Kratos take a shortcut, or did Kratos just go fast and overtake AMS? Speed. Just speed. Okay. Yeah, because I've been helping um, in the MSI Discord already. Someone uh, enter the different time and what they wanted for their ticket. What's their race after Zagoros? Okay. Uh, it was a shortcut. I believe you can. Yeah, I believe Twitch. Clip links are allowed. Try it. Also, Tenor missed a lap. Did Tenor go super wide? Also, Maddie will. That, that That's not what I quite mean with taking the Apex. Did anyone catch what happened to Tenor? Stuff keeps happening when I look away, because there's just so much that can happen on this track. Did Tenor go super wide over the finish line to lose a lap? Kratos trying the shortcut. Kratos trying the shortcut again. Failing. Kratos tried it. But now they're going to lose so much time. And oh, oh, they were in the lead. They tried to get the super lead. At least they didn't get as stuck as um, Total Chaos did. And they only lost, let's say, a handful of positions. Let's say 15-ish positions instead of a full lap. Oh, Kratos trying it, though. Hey, mess back in the lead. Let's see that clip. Yeah, Kratos is near the back of the field. And they took the shortcut well. They were like they were half a lap or so ahead. And then they must have had a bad angle somewhere. Thank you for getting the clips. Let's see. I'll, I'll see this one. This one's a bit longer. The one that Wake Hack sent me. It starts wide. And then suddenly goes hard left for the shortcut. It's a real good angle. Skips a lot of the track. Like as much as you can. But then... Do they get a bad angle somewhere? Yeah, on the apex of the turn. Which... Somewhere they lose time. Yeah, they lose some time with some bad angles, which brings AMS closer to them.
Tanner just did it, but didn't get the extra... Tanner did the shortcut? Oh, because they missed the finish line after doing the shortcut? No, I've not seen that combination before. No! That's not good. Tanner needs to get good results. So you're telling me. Tanner went over this bit. But then somehow had so much speed that they went high up on this hill and then they didn't get it? No. Final Viper there. We haven't had someone stuck like Brian was, but we have someone stuck that we know is going to not finish. So apparently it's possible. High on the inside? Tanner was on the inside. How do you stay on the inside? Didn't you just fall off the hill? Or did they bounce from the outside wall back to the inside wall? And that's also possible. Because normally you're not on the inside wall when crossing the finish line. Coach Kane shortcut. I, I caught the end of that. Coach Kane's on the shortcut. Can they get the angle right? Can they get going? Can they get a good lead on the first place? Coach Kane's with the shortcut. And they sort of are going. Yes, Coach Kane's took over the lead. This is exciting. Especially with people spreading out. You just look at that shortcut. Look around the finish line. It's exciting. Few people lap behind. Oh, Tanner almost two laps behind. It's so sad. They tried so hard. Apparently took the shortcut when I wasn't looking. And then one person stuck. And we're not even a quarter of the race in. In the dirt championship twice, I did not I did 20 lap races, I think. And then I did a 50 lap race once. We had Tw two races where the only shortcut that happened was on the final lap and that was successful and for the win i believe no one one of them was for second place because the that leader was super far ahead all right let's see is any, if anyone's doing it they need to stay high and then go hard left right at the end of that hill every steals goes doesn't quite go hard enough There's many that are trying it, but some trying harder than others. Because if you fail, we've seen that. You can lose a lot of time, especially Total Chaos felt that. You're st I'm st also still wondering how Viper got there. Yeah, I agree. They probably just had an angle that just got them really high up. And then another marble came from right behind them, bumped them, gave them a little bit of extra boost. Because you have the hill where um, right at the top where Conan is, and Tanner and uh, Coach Keynes is coming up on it. That right, the right hand turn, you go super high up on that hill. But I feel like there's an invisible wall there that allows you to not go over. Because otherwise, for sure, someone would have gone over that. So I don't know if someone got a clip of it. I didn't. Oh, Matty Will got a clip of Tanner Shortcut, or the one that they, they tried. I'll take a look at it in a second once most of the field has crossed this line again. Although, with now the field spread, you slept through the alarm. How goes it? Ah, oh, that sucks, Anders. I even put it at a good US time. <laughs> um, well, uh, Final Viper stuck in the outside of turn one. How can you the shortcut? <gasps> Let's go! <laughs> Did it? Wait. Yeah, no, I did the shortcut. I lead. <laughs> We've had so many shortcuts already. We've had shortcuts and then people failing the shortcut and going back and losing a lap. We've apparently had a shortcut of someone taking the shortcut, but then going wide over the finish line and then the lap didn't count. That's something I would like to um, look like if it's possible just to extend on Marble Canyon the finish line a bit to the left and right. So that if someone goes really high on the hill... Especially this happens on the outside hill, still rare, but on the outside hill, if someone goes really wide over the finish line, the lap doesn't count. And apparently, I've yet to see the tenor clip. If you then bounce to the if you take the shortcut, bounce on the outside wall, go back to the inside wall when you cross the finish line, you can also miss a lap. Get that thing with you in the lead if you haven't already. 
Yeah, no, because I just I forgot to clip my own shortcut. The shortcut that got me the lead. And the top five is quite a bit away from the rest. I just... When a shortcut occurs, whoever is doing the shortcut, just full caps type shortcut in the chat. And then shortcut and then a name of someone. And then hopefully someone clipped it or someone can clip it if they didn't notice immediately. Gravy Crunch trying it didn't work. Hmm... Alka's is hanging out with Dr. Ignatius with Conan. Alka's is going to put 10 or 2 laps down? Is that how this is going to happen? That's not how it's supposed to happen. Tanner, no one's supposed to be 2 laps down this early. And that's not me on Tanner. That's, no, that's sad. Tanner won the last race. Tanner won with Alderas. That was, no, that wasn't in the script. Speaking of Tanner, let's, let's look at that clip. Near the... Okay, let, let's see the tenor shortcut. The tenor shortcut that wasn't. So at the time, I was just, just a regular top five. Tenor was already a lap behind because of missing the line. Tenor does go super high. Takes the shortcut, so that works. Goes on the outside. Yeah, Tanner crosses the finish line on the inside wall and it didn't count, so that put Tanner another lap behind. If you lap me no cuddles for the morning? No! But I already have lapped you! <laughs> no! I don't get morning cuddles! I'm... Sorry, baby. I can't control it. <laughs> Okay, he's just here like, all right, I'm on your lap. I'm sleeping. <sighs> Why are you yelling so much? <sighs> well, there's a lot of shortcuts still possible. There's a lot of things still possible. Like, apparently I can get stuck. I can lose a lap if I go too wide over the line. I can try the shortcut again and then just lose time. Oh, Drag is almost getting it. I think the slightly increased speed in Unreal Engine, is it 5 now? Makes the shortcuts a little more likely than before. This would be good for running dirt track. Oh. But if I did work in progress, it could have happened too. I'm still excited for running the dirt track. Thing is, the most glorious thing would be if I win this race. I realized by saying that, I'm going to supposedly jinx myself but I'm leading on my own race I still haven't won my own race before I want to be I think I think it's the Thee Hunts won their own race Nyx won their own race twice they were first and then um who was it um I forgot her name she stopped like halfway season three usually did weekend races I believe Saturday races Older streamer. Anyway, she... I really liked her as a streamer. Um, Zagoros won... No, didn't Zagoros win sub-series when she hosted the sub-series race? Yeah, Nanograms. That's the one. That, that's the name I'm looking for. Na Nanograms won her race too, I believe. But Nick did it twice. I think it was both in season one. And then Theon did it season two. And then Nana did it in season three. Pretty sure Zagoros, when she once hosted sub-series... Drag race a shortcut! Drag race a shortcut! Happening live! Drag race on the shortcut! So they gain half a lap. Yeah, Zagros, I think, won sub series. Well, when they hosted sub series. And with that shortcut completed, Drag Racer does take the lead. At least it's work in progress, we know collisions are expected, yeah. Now, Alka either needs a really good race, Drag Razor needs a bad one, or Alka needs a shortcut again to win this race. <coughs> this is exciting. Just looking for that shortcut, having some chats.
Looking at the exit of turn one, or how they start turn two. Stay high up on that hill, and then near the end of it, suddenly go hard left. Meanwhile, Tenor and Viper are your wooden spoons today. Yeah, in terms of on the track right now, it's Tanner. But Viper will have the DNF. So unless someone else DNFs because they get stuck, Viper will get the lowest points. But at least they will get points because they were here. Because you still get your seasonal points for the Community Cup, as long as you were in the race. Mess has dropped back a little bit. They were leading earlier, but it was Coach Kane's Alk and then Drag Race all who took shortcuts to take over the lead. Viper gets a participation trophy, exactly. And they also get a really good view. Assuming they. Yeah, because I think they can look over the hill and they're not. No, they're stuck, so they probably can't see anything. Balls for it tried the shortcut. Alk is just with Dr. Ignatius and has a lot of space behind him. They wouldn't lose much if they tried the shortcut, but at the same time, <clears throat> getting second place is also really good. Just getting those points. I was top five in the first season of Community Cup. Tenor was second place in the second season of Community Cup, and I was second place in the third season of Community Cup. One of us is top five every time. And we've, as a couple, we've been second place twice. I think we were both top six after week one. So let's see how we can do. Tanner's already won a race this um this week. Let's see if I can do it. I'm chasing Drag Racer. How could just taking the normal lines, trying to lose as little time as possible. Remember, shout out the shortcut if you see it, because I'll be watching, especially for that shortcut, a lot. But sometimes I'll answer, let's say, a Discord message, look away for a second, pet the cat that's on my lap, um, help someone with their ticket in uh, for the Community Cup, something like that. Viper gets the most gang surprise. A great view and an official protest over running door track races ever again. <laughs> yeah, they'll be against it. <clears throat> Thing is, the main person that's going to run dirt tracks is me. If they happen, ooh, Brian almost taking the shortcut, but they almost repeated that with how late on the hill they would have done it. Ooh, Coach Gain's getting closer to Alka for second place. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to host community coverage for a while, most likely. So we'll see if that if dirt tracks were ever added. Also, there's a second dirt track added. I realized there's a tube one and then the track also. But the track is very similar to the, the other horse racing track. What was that one called? Uh, not Laughland. Emerald Downs, I think. Just, it, it doesn't have the slowdown issues. I thought it might have just been the new version. Kath the shortcut! Kath the shortcut! Kath on the shortcut! That would put Kath a second place, maybe third behind Alka. Third right now. But they need to get their angle right and get the forward momentum. Because the track pulls you in a certain direction, but you're mostly dependent on just the left and the right from the hills. Katha seems to have good momentum now. Slots in in fourth place after that shortcut. You know, it looks like Tenor is going to need at least one shortcut, probably two, to even have a shot at some decent points. You're saying you're getting DNF'd. Um, I believe the timer is always two minutes. After a race, you two lap based on the record right now being 112, being three laps down would be about the DNF fall, I would think. Something like that. So I think if everything goes very normally, no one shortcuts, no one gets stuck, whatever, I expect you to still finish. But we still have well over half the lap to go, uh, half the race to go, so we'll see. Look at that, two and a half laps down from your leader. <laughs> yeah. Drag Race is still in that lead spot. With a big lead over Auka. Auka got overtaken by Coach Gaines. 
So I could slow down. Coach can get some speed. Definitely good. Coach can get a gap to Katha and then just overtook Alka for second. Yeah, that's about two and a half laps. Katha trying it again. This is exciting, though. Just with the shortcuts and also just how... With the different hills and angles of it, how that can change the order. Because <clears throat> on certain tracks, let's say the Brick or em Emerald Downs, perhaps. The, 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 that's more a dirt track. A track without a lot of corners. Sure, you can have a few positional changes, especially if everyone's super close together. You have loads of marbles. Andy Mamra's always throwing shortcut. Ooh. Um... But there's a few tracks, like, let's say, the Brick, that doesn't have a lot of positional changes, because there's not a lot of Alka for the shortcut. Nope. A um, few positional changes here and there, but it's on tracks like the Saber, where you have a bunch of lefts followed by rights, rights followed by lefts, hard turns into hard turns. That's where the angle in which you approach one turn affects the exit of it, affects the entry to the other turn, which affects your speed a lot. Which can make it more unpredictable, more surprising who changes where positions where. And it's a lot more... And otherwise, in certain other tracks, let's say the brick, if you're in, let's say, second place, and everyone's almost in a line... I already checked. I saw it, Tanner. You, you've revoked Cuddles for the next hour. <laughs> um, so everyone's in a line, and let's say you're in second place, you can expect... You can maybe get first that lap. Maybe you'll drop down a bit, but you're not going to go farther down than fifth that lap. If at all. So that's... Like, it's still fine to have races on the brick and the track to exist. But I think the more exciting ones are where it's more unpredictable. While it's not... Um... What's, what's the word for it? I don't know. I feel like the, the angles of this of this track plus the hills... Admiral Kratos trying it again! Kratos falling back because they got the angle wrong. They tried it so hard. But only just failed. No, they're trying it again. Kratos might still work. No, the <gasps> Kratos is gonna get stuck. No, 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 you're going the wrong way. Kratos, go down. Kratos, go down. Go down. Okay, just get out. Get out. You're, you're a lap down now. You're a lap down now. But just find your angle. Find your angle. You're a lap down. But just, just go. You don't get stuck. Go. Go. Heaven sent. Heaven sent shortcut. Goes far. So that could be them going back and forth for a while, unless they get hit into. But Heaven Sent got a shortcut. If they can get the angle right. Lead, maybe no. But with a bit of a lack of pace, that is second place. Coach Kane's close, though, and Heaven Sent still has to find their groove a little bit. But Heaven Sent got the shortcut. Take second place. That shortcut is very valuable. The podium finishes in this race, likely all will have done at least one successful shortcut. But it's just a risk, because if you get it wrong, you lose a lot of positions, especially if you get super, super close and then don't make it. Because <clears throat> then you've seen what happens to Total Chaos, you've seen what happens to Admiral Kratos. That's a lot of time lost. <clears throat> With the people chatting so far in this race, which is helped, I guess, by the time of the day in which this race happens, plus the fact that we're just a Marble Candy and we're looking at the shortcut and it's super exciting and I'm really happy about it, I'm talking a lot more, so my throat's <clears throat> not having as much fun. <coughs> hmm. Ooh, Katha going really wide. Calls for you, going really high, just failing it, same for Alderas. Drag Racer going relatively high, trying to get an even bigger lead, because they're already in the lead. Aoka went for a hard left, but a little too late, so they didn't make the shortcut. That cost them a bit of time. 
Owning Crater Zornak all pretty high on that hill. Katha just trying to take the normal line. Same for Mrs. Mikey GG's. AMS now down to ninth due to some of the other shortcuts that have happened. They've just driven a normal race and are currently in ninth. Being chased by Bellamombe Gangster by Gravy Crunch. Top three are relatively close together now. Coach Kane's definitely with the most speed right now. Drag Race is there. Actually, I haven't sent a little bit further ahead. Aukus lost some time. A lot of marbles are together right now. We had a big spread, but a lot of marbles found each other again. Is there an advantage? Like, what you might want when you take the shortcut is to have a big group, about two-thirds of the... No, a third, maybe half a lap. No, let's say a third of the lap behind you, because then when you just get out of the shortcut, you might just bump into someone and they give you a push forward in the right what, in the right uh, direction. Which costs you a bit less time. Sin Defense trying that shortcut is super close but falls back. <coughs> and that gives them a bad angle again. They're going to need some time to, cat, to find that forward momentum on the track. Get a little bit of a bump from Conan to help them in the right direction. Evan sent with a little bit of a lead. You get it to the start of the shortcut when Drag Race crosses the line. AMS trying it. Mm, two heart left, AMS. Uh, they fell out of the top ten on the last lap for the first time this race. They were like, oh, I need the shortcut and we can do some cool things and I can be in a podium position. But that's the risk of that shortcut. If you fail, sometimes you fail hard. You lose a lot of time. That is the big risk of it. It seems to have found their angle again a lot sooner than I expected, considering where they were. But that is now a lap down for AMS. Yeah, that's about one and a half laps down on the leader. They already had just over half. Lap. They are with Gangsta plays and Miss Mikey GG's again, so they lost almost a full lap. Because they were somewhere between Miss Mikey GG's and Gravy Crunch. Before they attempted that shortcut. Heaven sent trying it. At least they get just over that turn 2 hill. They don't lose too much. But that does bring Coach Games close to the second place. Alka's hanging out with Manny. Maybe mod streamer trying to figure out a strategy together. I might upload just the full VOD of this race. Just so people can watch it. Because normally I don't like upload any of my Marvel stuff outside of there being one really exciting clip. But I might upload the full VOD of this to YouTube because it's the first Community Cup Dirt Race. And people might find it interesting to watch if people can try to find it. This is wild. I like this a lot. <laughs> I like this track a lot. And just the racing, the amount of shortcuts, and especially shortcut attempts, but also successful shortcuts we've seen so far. It's really exciting. And I like it a lot. Now, if Alka Marble could just like, take the shortcut again successfully and then win, because I haven't won my own race yet, please. Please, Alka Marble. <laughs> I'm hypnotized on the track. <laughs> Yay! We have believers! <laughs> Something I have um, posted to end it as an idea. No, not confirmed that it's happening whatsoever. It's just an idea, and Enders hasn't said anything about even there being a potential of it happening. Yeah, Vinyl Viper's not key, and I understand. Um, but I said that normally you have you have ten now ten regular lap tracks, and now you have six dirt tracks. What if instead of someone every time someone a host submits a ticket to host a race, they choose a number from one to ten. Alcatraz, that shortcut doesn't quite work. Uh, they choose a number from one through ten. Wait, what? Did Tanner lose another lap? Huh? No, no, that's three laps down now, right? 
No, no, that's almost four. That's almost four laps down. What? Tanner must have... Tanner must have gone wide over the line again. Why is this happening to just Tanner? Like, one other person did that, like Leon, I believe, in the first ten laps. Tanner tried the shortcut twice. Once worked, but they f went wide, and then did they go wide again? Oh no. Francisco going really high in the outside turn two. No, turn one. If they would have gotten a bump, then maybe they would have joined the final Viper. Tender hashtag petition for no dirt. Fix it before you run it again. Yeah, I do agree. If this becomes a more regular thing, the dirt tracks in general, but especially this. Um, if Enders or someone else could please look into just extending the, the finish line. Just a little bit left and right into the wall, if possible. Because I'm not sure how high it tracks where your marble is, because normally your marble is just on the ground. But if it's possible to extend it a little bit more into the wall, so that if someone goes really high in the inside or outside wall, that they could still make it. Um, I th feel like that's something that um, could be nice for this track. Cheaters couldn't always prosper. Like the shortcutters? But it ha the thing is, this happened... Oh, Gangsta must have taken the shortcut. Did I miss gangs that taking a shortcut? They're suddenly in fourth. And I, I dropped down to ninth, so I was I feel like I've just been slow. There has been a there is a big group together though. I definitely just dropped back. No, gangsta might have just been in the group that was fast. Yeah. I think gangsta didn't take the shortcut, but was just in a group um with Micah GG's, with Katha, and they closed up on each other, and that's how you got fourth. Because me about they're in the bottom right. Coach Gain's at the top. Heaven Sense on the left. And Drag Racer's already at the shortcut again. Gap from P1 to P10 is three quarters of a lap at this point. Alco is really high in that first hill, but it's too early to try the shortcut. Gravy Crunch goes hard left, but not hard enough left. You just falling back asleep? No? Oh, you're getting off right when I say that you're asleep. You can stay. Also, I'm, I might stream later today again, like some Pokemon or something. I haven't decided yet. I want to stream more, but because I, I realized I've streamed mostly just Community Cup. Recently, and then the occasional Forever Lock finale on, on my Pokemon playthroughs. But I want to find another stream game. Especially now that I'm not going to do Community Cup anymore. I might, I'll, I'll still stream the occasional marbles, but not Community Cup. Um, but I want to find something like a regular other game. Probably Pokemon related, because I love Pokemon. I'm going to try and find it. Maybe a cool fan game, like a rum hack. I don't know yet. Or some sp or a specific type of, type of challenge. I haven't figured that out yet. But I want to I wanna find something like that. If you went to go. Oh, you're right behind me. Hi. You want scratches? The stream hasn't seen much of you because you've just been sleeping. Just been sleeping on my lap. And then right before stream when I got the... Uh, when I got some food for myself and some drinks. Icky over here. Went downstairs because they were like, I need attention from you. And then when I went back upstairs, Uki went back upstairs, tried to drink my milk again. And then got on my lap and fell asleep. I really need to find the shortcut, but knowing my luck, my fate would be similar to Tenor's. You want to go downstairs, Eric? You can go. Bye-bye. It was nice having you here. Thanks for giving my legs a bit of a rest. Because you've been there for a while. Just yell Mao really loud or just scratch on my door when you want back in. See ya. 
All right, did I miss anything? Top 10 doesn't seem to have changed too much. Well, this is going to be a short race. It's going to go to like an hour. Like, this is just me calculating the laps, but I did it based on the calculations that I did for the Dirt Championship at the start of the offseason. Where 15 to 20 laps was between... No, 15 to 20 minutes was 20 laps. So I thought if I just do that times four, while Manny tries to shortcut but doesn't quite make it. I thought if I just do that times four, it will be between an hour and hour twenty. Now the first place finisher was a lot would have been a lot close to the hour mark, but that that did include the DNF timer. Manny went up that little path, but you need the momentum to go up that other hill. That loses Manny more time. Even though I feel like Manny must have taken the shortcut because Manny was already a lap behind on me. But now he still is. Did Manny take another shortcut but then fail the second time? Let's see, it's drag racing now right behind Tenor trying to put them four laps down. How could drop back to the, the back of the top ten? They were leading at one point. I got excited, maybe winning my own race, but that was super early because, you know, there's. We're only 20 laps in at the time. We're almost 60 laps in. 45 minutes. Yeah, the fi the P1 finisher will be just over an hour, I think. Plus, the DNF time will be just over an hour. So, probably this track could have, let's say, 85 to 90 laps if we make it the regular thing. I didn't use the website to calculate it. This is just based on my own calculations for Dirt Championship. It's a little calm in terms of the shortcut outside the attempt that Manny had recently. Marbles is going a little wide, turn one, but then going down early to get a nice angle for turn two and not losing much time. I think Aug is realizing that he just needs to get some regular positions before even attempting it, because he does risk a top um, getting outside of the top ten. Like He's risking losing that top ten finish if he even attempts that shortcut. There's a few marbles a lap down that he wouldn't lose to, but there's a lot of positions that he will. Alcus Marco Marbles now in 7th. Alka might drop back to 20th if he fails the shortcut pretty hard. And we've seen Marbles lose a full lap by just trying the shortcut and getting the angles wrong. Coach Gaines has dropped back a bit from 2nd place, get the angle wrong there out of turn 2. How'd you get so far ahead? Well, I shortcut a long time ago, and then some good angles on the on the walls. Drag racer right now, closing up on that finish line, trying to put ten or fourth lap down. Adding some good angles, getting pushed forward, perhaps. They're looking very good. Imagine drag racer doing a shortcut again, and successful. At that point, you would expect them to win, unless they then tried the shortcut multiple times. And not making it, I paused there for a moment because Dr. Ignatius was really close to a shortcut. How can that close fight with Bellamon, with Gangster, with Miss Mikey GG? It's the 6th through ninth that are close together there. It's Chicken in 10th, who's only now in turn 1, so that's a bit of a gap. So Drag Racer has almost lapped P10. You have Chicken... Chicken R00. Going into the bottom right right now, and Drag Racer is the marble that's close in that group. That's P10. Almost being lapped here. Kratos had a good angle to try the shortcut, but they didn't go too hard left out of uh, off that wall, so that didn't work. But maybe they, that Kratos marble decided, I've already tried it twice and failed relatively hard. Let's just not try it again, it's not working. 
trying to just have some normal angles, trying to gain some normal speed the normal way, and then maybe others fail at it, then they gain some positions that way. Poach gains goes high up, goes pretty hard left. Doesn't quite make it. Still relatively alone in P3 right now for Coach Canes. They have a big gap to P4. It's Kath and Miss Micah GG's Auka. Gangsta. It's Ornak there. Bellamom a little further back. That Kratos Marble seems to be trying it less hard now because they just don't want to fail it when they try super hard. Drag racer, close to checking still, but they still haven't overtaken for for that uh, lap of P10. Meanwhile, Heaven Sent is closing in on that first spot. Drag race is getting caught up in all that traffic. Heaven Sent is closing in. Alka Marble is at the lead of his group. It's a very big gap, almost half the track. Between P3 and P4, but Alk is now leading that big group again that is now P4 to P9. That are very close together with a few um, cars, marbles of traffic in between. Just AMS, Kratos, uh, Mikey GG's, and Gravy Crunch. They're near. But Alka wants to get those positions back. Also, he doesn't want to get lapped. Wide marbles in that turn too, but no shortcut for a little bit. Meanwhile, Vinyl Viper! Wanna take a look at how Vinyl Viper's doing? <laughs> let's take a look at how Vinyl Viper's doing. Actually, no, let's see this big group if anyone in the top 10 tries a shortcut. Actually, we'll slowly go to Vinyl Viper just in case the shortcut is ended. What did Ornak do? Did they try shortcut? Did I miss that? No, I think they would have just fallen back, because they were already in top 10. So they must have just had a really weird angle. They lost time, which means... P10 has now been left, because Ornak fell backwards. Chicken is now in ninth. Yeah, so Final Viper went up this hill, with a sp very specific angle, probably. Coach Kane's shortcut, tries it. Goes backwards to get that's not what you need. There's a big gap to P4, which is gangster right now, but they're going. That's going wrong. Alk is going to take this. Passes Coach Canes. Uh, the co together with Coach Canes, maybe. Now it's a fight for P3, 4, 5. Yeah, so Final Viper can't actually see the track unless they can see through this crack over here. Um, they're just enjoying the sounds. Alka chasing a podium position now that Ornak's falling back a little bit. Oh, sorry. That is a close fight for that podium. Where's Drag Racer? Drag Racer is already on the right side. Drag Racer is less than a... No, it's a, about a quarter of a lap away from lapping the podium. Drag Racer is on a mission to lap as many as possible. I feel like the best option for Drag Racer is to just not attempt the shortcut. As long as I don't attempt the shortcut, even if they happen to get some bad angles on some of the hills and corners, they have a huge lead. Drag Race is at the finish line right now. Heaven Sent is at the top of the track. So that's, I'd say, a third of the track ahead. Drag Racer has lapped Gravy Crunch. Oh, Gravy Crunch was already lapped. It has lapped Bellamo. So that's the top. No, that's P8 backwards now lapped. Admiral Crater is the second lap down. If Drag Racer keeps this up, they can get to Alka. They're not far off. They're not far off Alka. 
Alka just needs one not working shortcut. Then speaking of that, where they try it, no, they went left too late. They really need to go really hard left off of that hill. Amex is trying a completely different turn to staying on that hill. See if that works for them. Manny going really wide through turn one. Goes hard left, but too early. That didn't work. This is exciting. I love this race. I'm so happy I got to do this race. It was going to be Marble Canyon because it's my favorite track. It's my favorite track in the game. I'm very happy I chose it. Alka shortcut! Alka shortcut! Yes! Yes! Good angle! Good angle! Good angle! <laughs> okay. Get get the right angle. Get your momentum. Get your momentum. Get your momentum. Drag Race had such a lead on Alka, like three quarters of a lap, that Alka didn't actually take the lead there. He just effectively gained one position, but three quarters of a lap. Alka has most of his momentum forward again. Well into second place ahead of Heaven Sent. Let's go. Second shortcut and I'm not even leading because Drag Race is having such a good race. Two successful shortcuts. Drag Race has had one, but just had a, in general, very good angles, very good speed throughout the race. The Drag Race with now Alka chasing him close behind instead of Alka being chased by Drag Race to get lapped. I was like, I'm going to get lapped while on the podium? No, -uh. not happening. Oh, Alka with a bad angle there, losing some time in the final corner. The well, final few corners, depending on how you look at it. But still, well in second place. In a way that was very risky from Alka, because there wasn't a lot to win, but a lot to lose based on where he was. But he went for it, and it was successful. Close well, to Heaven Sent in P3, then Drag Race in P1. Gangsta plays P4, is crossing the line now. It's Coach Kane's Katha, 5 and 6. And this is Mikey GG's in 8th. Chicken went up to 7th. And then there's Andy Mumro's still just behind Drag Racer. So the top. So it's P9 now in the best position that is lapped. Drag Racer still a decent bit ahead of Alka. Definitely the last lap hasn't been great for Alka. And while this exciting race has been going, we only have eight laps to go. There isn't a lot of time to change things. Will there be one final shortcut, one final hurrah? Because dra where's Drag Racing compared to Heaven Sent? Where's Heaven Sent? It's about half the track. Maybe just mm, just under half the track, maybe. In the late of... I I'm trying to think. If Heaven Sent were to take the shortcut now and doesn't lose too much time, where will they end up compared to Drag Racer? I feel like if Heaven Send does it, they might just take the lead. If they then have a good lap after that too, because Alka was relatively close by Drag Racer, but then had a lap, a bad lap after that. Like if Heaven Send has a relatively good shortcut and then follow up lap, they might do it. Which I guess goes for Alka too, because Alka's another like bad angle on the hills. The shortcut was still successful. And he's still gained positions from it, but he's lo he has lost time since. He's a lot farther away from Drag Race than it was just three laps ago. Six laps to go in this race. Drag Race is on lap 75. Alk in second place at the top of the track. Still lap 74. And remember, if you just go on the f far right for the marbles, bottom left on our screen, if you go past that finish line there, you don't gain a lap. Drag Race is leading a big group with round chicken R00. So that's P7. Drag Race is putting the lap on P7. With Katha in P6, not too far ahead.
Alka fighting Heaven Sent for that second place. Heaven Sent got closer. The gap to Gangsta plays who is in P4 is uh, very large. Because that's another half lap. Yeah, Heaven Sent and Alka, as long as they don't try the shortcut, they should be safe on a podium finish. Drag Racer, knowing that there's just over four laps to go, they should just not try the shortcut. Just go with the flow and they should win. But we've seen in the Dirt Championship, in the four long races that we did, a 20, a 20, a 20, and a 50 lap race, twice a successful shortcut on the final lap. And if on the final lap you take the shortcut, you like half the time you lose from the bad angles exiting the shortcut comes after the finish line. You don't have that if it's on the final lap because you've already crossed the line. So if you get a successful shortcut on the final lap, then that is a lot more valuable than any other lap. Because most of the time you lose is after the finish line and around turn one. Unless you get like a really bad angle, you just keep going back and forth like I saw earlier. You making a note saying that you were stuck there? A lovely view of a rock. Yeah, it's a lovely view of a rock. Yeah, yeah. We 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 had a view from Vinyl Viper's point of view a little earlier. That was it was not a lot to see, unfortunately. Unless there's like a little crack between the rocks. Maybe uh, Vinyl Viper can give us more insight on that. Heaven Sense seems to be relatively safe on B2, but knowing the track and just one bad angle can really mess you up. Drag raises at the top, two and a half laps to go. It's not a boulder, it's a rock! <laughs> Have respect for the rock! Wish I could join you up there myself instead of getting that. <laughs> two laps to go for the leader. Alka hanging out with Dr. Ignatius again, a lap ahead of Dr. Ignatius. I think Alcamobo really needed those shortcuts because his general pace has not been that great outside of the first five to ten laps. He's lost time compared to most marbles and he's still hanging out with Dr. Ignatius, falling back to where he was before he took the shortcut in terms of track position. P4 is now Katha. Katha overtook Gangsta, overtook Coach Canes, is leading that P4 group. One lap to go. One lap to go for Drag Racer. Final lap. Is anyone going to try this shortcut on the final lap? Drag Racer goes high, doesn't try it too hard because they realize the risk. AMS gets a bit of a bump the wrong way. Viper's doing his best John Cena impression. You can't see me. <sighs> Getting some wrestling references in here. Alka enters the final lap in P3. Very safe. Just don't try the shortcut. Unless you want to win real hard. No, just goes for the safety. I get it. I'm not going to win my own race even now. But Alka's going to go for the safe P3. Well, P4, 5, 6, 7, 8. They are crossing that line. Drag Racer fell back a little bit. Close to Gangsta plays in P6. So P7 backwards were lap. Drag Racer 6, 6, 1. Wins the first ever Community Cup Dirt Race. Heaven Sends coming down for second place. Alka's in a group hanging out with Dr. Ignatius and a few others. Like he has for well, quite a lot of that race, Dr. Ignatius and Alka have been together. Had the shortcut twice. Only managed third because the general pace was relatively low. But that's a P3. The P4 fight is still on. Coach Kane's decided to press the turbo button right at the end. Was on the podium position for a long time, failed a shortcut, but still get a fourth place. Then Gangsta, Katha, Chicken finishes. Here comes Bellamon for P8. Terry Nicole for ninth. And then Andy Mumrose for Mrs. Mikey GG's. Mikey GG's trying to block Andy Mumrose to make Mrs. Mikey GG's make it, but Andy Mumrose is just ahead. And apparently I'm still not getting cuddles, yeah. I, I don't think I'm gonna get cuddles. But I feel like. There's going to be three marbles remaining in the final few seconds on the track. This total chaos, probably not going to finish. And then final Viper. Can you see the podium center ceremony from up there? 
Maybe we should just do the podium ceremony on that rock. Admiral Kratos losing a few positions at the end to Conan and AMS. Get some bad angles out of the final few corners. Uh, Total Chaos, maybe if they're fast, they might just make it. Total Chaos might just make it to the finish. If they have good angles on the final lap. Unfortunately, Tenor... Sorry, I, I, I'm going to have to do without Cuddles for a little while. It was not their race. So I guess that's a P31 then for Tenor. Although I guess because they DNF, it might... They're actually, they're a lap ahead of... No. Would it count? No, Total Chaos didn't make it either. Let's see if... The order was Chaos, then Tenor, then Viper. We'll see if that's the case. But Drag Racer 661 wins the dirt race. Let's get that copied over into my results sheet. There we go. I'll load it up again just to make absolutely sure that it's correct. 